Sanjay Maru inside of Maximum Training Center alongside Darren Damore. Darren, a dominant victory in your Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu exhibition bout. Did you think the victory would be that easy? Uh, I, I knew I was going to win, but I didn't, I didn't think it would be that quick. I thought we'd have a little bit more, a couple scrambles and stuff, but I knew, uh, I knew I'd win. I, just, I didn't think it would be that, that quick. And how long have you been uh, training for? Uh, I've been training for about six, seven years now at Central Combat Sports under Peter Zeron. Okay, and tell me a little bit about the tutelage of your trainers. Obviously, whatever you're learning, you've been learning the right stuff. I mean, that was an extremely dominant performance. So tell me a little bit about your trainers. Uh, so I train with a lot of jiu-jitsu black belts, uh, three on, on regular and then a couple you know, on the side for training partners and some assistant coaches and stuff. Uh, the guys you saw there, Goran and Tyler, are my main training partners. So uh, they're both jiu-jitsu black belts, so they have a lot of experience. And they get me prepped for uh, things that I want to do, like a tournament or a match. And then we just we train all the time. You know, He's, We're always refining our games. And I'm in the gym pretty much every day and just, just, just training, man. Just love it. And what are you looking to do with this now? You got a great first victory under your belt. Are you looking to pursue a career in mixed martial arts? Or I want to get punched in the face. Um, I'm just sticking to jiu-jitsu right now, no gi grappling. Uh, I do a lot of other things outside of the gym, so I don't limit myself to one thing. Uh, I'm open to doing a lot more like, uh, you know, sub-only matches and stuff like that at the higher level. I want to start versing some higher level guys and, you know, some, some brown belts, some black belts in Windsor or outside of Windsor or whatever. And that's what I'm looking towards now and just continuing school and continuing just having fun, living life, you know. What are you in school for, by the way? I'm in uh, CYW at St. Clair College, Child and Youth. So is this something that you would use as a side job as you pursue youth and child care, or is this something where you would maybe move on from your academic career to pursue this full time? Uh, possibly. Like I love helping people. You know, I work at Community Living Windsor, so I really enjoy what I do. So I, I never really give that up. It's just a part of who I am. Uh, just is a part of who I am too. Like I just love helping people in the gym and you know refining my own skills, having that family environment, teamwork, friendship. So it's something I'm just going to continue doing. I'll I'll be doing it to the day I die, rather, if I'm competing or if I'm just helping people in the gym or whatever I'm doing, whatever comes my way, I'll, I'll jump on the opportunities that I want and, you know, we'll see how it goes from there. Now, the victory that you got, was that a face crank or a rear naked choke? The angle I was seeing it from was a little hard to tell. Well, I'm a little mean. Sometimes I start with the, with the, with the face crank and then I sink it into the rear naked choke. So at first his chin was tuck and I just go on the chin rather than try to readjust my, readjust my grip. So I just go right over and kind of squeeze. You saw me squeezing for a long time because I kind of squeezed past the point where the guy pops his chin. And I heard him kind of like gurgling and making some noise and stuff. So I knew I had to choke. So I just kind of, I stayed on the grip and I got the tap. So. Perfect. Once again, that's Darren Damore. He's one of the best and brightest in the world of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Be sure to follow his career. Where can people find you on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram? Uh, you can find me on Instagram, Darren Damore, D-A-R-R-I-N, Darren dot Damore, so Darren, D-A-R-R-I-N dot Damore, D-A-M-O-R-E. Um, I don't do Twitter, really. Facebook, you can, I guess, look me up, but I'm probably not going to accept your friend request. I have too many people on Facebook. So yeah, hit me up on Instagram or just come by the gym, Central Combat Sports, you know, always training, always having fun, or catch me uh, downtown Windsor for a drink or two.